aerial and ground combat with lightning fast maneuvers. Next, no, Jason Blum and his Blumhouse. Oh, here it is. Become synonymous here it with incredible is. horror films over the years, like Get Out, Megan, and last year's Five Nights at Freddy's. Well, now Blumhouse is right? entering the They're making game a game. World it's called Five Nights at Freddy's. Way. They're making a game based on the movie Five Nights at Freddy's. Okay, Halloween. Halloween, 100%. Wait, no, it looks cartoony. Okay, all right. The black phone, okay. Maybe it's gonna be everybody. All their characters in one game. A Dead by Daylight with Blumhouse characters. The, the Nun? Do they do that? You know, okay. Crisis. Cry, Chrysal Theater of Idols. Look at No, it's just a new thing. Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, okay. More games. Watch out! Grave Seasons from Perfect Garbage. I cannot sleep. I cannot sleep. I must not sleep. Sleep awake from eyes out. Okay. To sleep. Damn, this is all original and stuff. I am okay. To death to stay awake. There's gotta be one thing that's based on one of their Don't movies, worry, right? Viv. If any ghosts actually show up, Ouija? I'll protect you. Uh, fear the spotlight. Okay. I was gonna say, what was that one game? I mean, one movie. Uh, talk to me, but that that was a hand. That wasn't Ouija. The local police department asked me to help with a case. Oh, that was A24, though, anyway. So never mind. Why would they need a game designer? The simulation? Wow, it's god damn, all right. They got a lot. Oh, that's scary. No, 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 no. Oh, oh, so you're a game designer working on a game. OK, that's kind of cool. Oh, Sam Barlow, nice. Oh, bra oh my god. All right, Project C. Hey, I like Brandon Cronenberg. Okay. Okay. All right. Hey. Yeah, the games look better than the movies. Yeah, that's, that's probably... No, that's not even probably true. Uh, all those or imaginary. I bet every one of those games costs the same amount to make as the imaginary movie. Then, Oh, combined. Please welcome Jason Blum, CEO oh. and founder okay. of Blumhouse, and Luis Blaine, creative lead at Blumhouse Games. Boo! No, I'm just kidding. Bring Steve Blum out. No relation. Yeah, some of those games look hey pretty guys, good. So we got ourselves a full slate there. But I need to see more. So, so Jason, I, guys, I better about, look at all those. Uh, why do you want to get into games like this? What are we doing? They might well, still do it. Been, uh, they might very, make very a game busy. based on one of their movies. Um, I have a feeling they might Thank announce something else us. at the Thank end here. Thank you guys all. Great to hear uh, the fans out there. And some with uh, Brendan Cronenberg and, and Sam Barlow. You'll, you'll all be Project very C, happy to know we're working at this very Five Nights minute at Freddy's. on the sequel of Five Nights at Freddy's. It's coming. Woo! Don't worry. Maybe anyway, this time we'll, you know. Is, uh, yeah, never mind. <laughs> my great relief. Two hours. Getting These are usually two more hours. Popular. Our movies are working. It's working on streaming. It's working in live events. And we wanted to Where's Happy Death Day 3? Our approach Jason Cumb. to movies and apply it to games. <laughs> that's how simple that's my humor is. Here. I left We're going to do independent games. We're going to look for creators Actually, is there a and subtitles? give them a platform and, and encourage that. these creators to oh, be weird go. and subversive and find the most effed up, scariest right, things Maybe they not. Can They're already fucked up. Put them into see. really cool <laughs> games. Does anybody need those? <laughs> Well, they, they look they look great. It's a really diverse, cool slate. Uh, Luis, tell us a bit about we saw Black a bunch of Black was delayed on Xbox. Kind of I'll get on PS5 game. then. Fuck As it. As you just saw from our slate, our horror games are a lot like Blumhouse movies. They come in many different flavors of fear, which means there's a horror game <laughs> for everyone. Isis. So maybe you're a fan of nostalgic 90s experiences with a bit of a twist, <laughs> intense first-person shooters. Or maybe, Jeff, you just want some bonus That first game was the most exciting one for me. That looked like a, a straight-up horror I game. Think, you know, we, as horror fans, we know that there's so many different subgenres. Gave me a painkiller vibe a little bit. And our Not independent really, development partners, they feel the same, and they're just as Not excited, which What's means we've got psychological nightmares, we have supernatural dying. scares, we have cosmic horror. <laughs> and our team has worked really hard to work with global These creative These are jokes, by the way, before partners. someone watches this later and on and says sexism and shit. We really want to. I just spilled over myself. 
as we're working in indie projects, yeah. which means that we can take risks. Hey, take your time. We can be flexible. Uh, the show's we two hours. You can hey, sit down, chill out. Storytelling, and we're we so ain't excited. fucking doing anything. Yeah, no, it, it looks, looks. Games are awesome. dumb anyway. Fuck it. There, and I know, you know, we'll get into <laughs> when games are coming like, out. But games are dumb. Are take your time. Soon, Jason, it's right? all we stupid. Well, yeah, we're on uh, we're on PC and console, and um, and uh, yeah, we wanted to start with uh, with not just one, but we wanted to start with a few games. So uh, so you want to you want to tell us about those? Yeah. So Fear the Spotlight is our first release oh, okay. coming later this year, and it really hits our mission statement. It's an amazing '90s horror experience. It's got great characters, a compelling narrative. It's also super creepy. Which one was that I again? I wish they were showing gameplay for it because there was a lot too many there horror. to remember and all the names. Quickly, actually, Fear the Spotlight is getting its first trailer as part of the yeah. Day of the Dev Showcase. Oh. So stay tuned after the show. Directly after. Okay. Awesome. Well, okay. I know this is just the start, so we'll probably be seeing you in future years with more. I do want to see Mel Gasol. Awesome. What do you think of the slate? Pretty amazing. Uh, right? She's just nervous. Jason, Luis, thanks so Jason, much. Jason, get the fuck off the stage. Game. Thank you, guys.